is Lair of the Lost Children. Close your food hole or you'll stay here in your cage. Okay, okay. Man, you don't have to get all sensitive. I'm sorry, okay? You, you had it coming, bitch. What's the hops, bro? I don't know what the hops are, but hello everyone and welcome to today's video where we are back in Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines, where we are just mopping up some old jobs. We did find a little idol for Pisha in the museum, so we're just going to return that to her quick. Hello, Pisha. Yes. The shrunken man for you, widow. Yes. This is genuine and of use to me. There is something resonating from it. A whisper. I will give you this in trade. It is known as the odious chalice. It swells with spilled blood and offers its bloat to its owner. Ooh, very nice. Thank you. Yes. Another question. Uh, about the prizes you seek. Yes. The Giovanni it prize. It is used to communicate with certain entities otherworldly. Oh. It is a tome called the Voce del Morte. Voice of the Dead, Should eh? you find yourself within the walls of the Giovanni, seize the opportunity and take it, for they will make sure you never have another. I honestly don't know if I ever will be in the Giovanni mansion, but, uh, we'll see, we'll see. <laughs> I'm sure I will be at some point, surely. Anyway. On to the next task. Right, so it's uh, a job for Becky. I need to get into the library, which I believe is this building here. And it says in the quest that there's an entrance in the sewers. So presumably, it should be easy to spot, in theory. Like that. What is that? Oh. Aha! We're in. Right. Didn't say I had to be stealthy or anything, so... Vacuum tubes? That's for electrical circuits. Right, okay, so the lift's not working. Uh, oh, hello. Ah, job done. All right, okay. I was right. Electrical circuits, indeed. All right. Do -do -do. Well, we went underground, so presumably we're in the basement, so we need to go up. My voice is around a field day. What's happening here? Oh, can I hear someone walking around? If it's a guard, it didn't say anything about not killing anyone. Nice. I didn't lose any humanity there, so that was good. <laughs> That's oh, hello. I'll eat you as well. <laughs> right. Start on the left. Sit here. Oh, shiny, shiny, shiny. Ooh, library card. I can now take out books. Knowledge is my power. Right, what is going on? Is there anything around here? There seems to be anything here. Let's double check these doors, make sure we can't exit. No. Alright, let's check the other side of the hall. Aha! Who are you? This section managed by Mumbly Joe. Have I met Mumbly Joe before? What's oh, a computer? Hello. Uh, I've got a card. Insert card. Insert cards. Trophy. Oh, very nice. Uh, unlock. Was unlocked. It. That wasn't helpful. Uh, hidden switch. I've seen that. Yeah, see it. What's this? Oh. All right. Since the music started, so. Oh, hello. Oh no, blood. I don't like it. Spiral staircases can do one. Ugh. 
Ugh. Oh, this looks ominous. I agree. Ah, it seems. Oh, it's you again. Final Hello. Night has brought us together once again. I see you've begun to embrace the beast within you. I smell the sweetest blood of my brethren upon your very hands. But enough with the pleasantries. Witness the power of my flesh transformed into the vessel of your destruction. Farewell, young K-Knight. Okay. Right. Um, did I pick up a sword? I did. That is much better than my katana. Swish it. And in the interest of beating the past piss out of him... <laughs> uh. No, none of that, sir. I will vision a deaf you. No, sorry, veil of madness. Oh, that hurt. Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? <laughs> Come back here, you dickface. La Sombra? I don't think so. Oh, ow, ow, ow. I need blood heal. Well, man, this is a good one. Because he can't do anything. And I'll just run up to him and slap him in the face. He's fallen. Ow. That's a lot of damage. If he hits me once, I'm gonna die. <laughs> oh god. Suck it, the Sombra! In your face! Right. Is that it? Anything down there? Can I open that? Is it the coffin? Nothing. There's nothing here! Oh, well, we completed the quest, though. Nice. Okay, let's go. So he tells me I should have left those guards alive to eat on the way out. Oh. No! Oh, go! Ah! That oh, she. What the hell was he doing in there? Does that mean there's going to be more downstairs? I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Don't mess with a man with broadsword, fellas. I'm just saying. Oh, that's surprising. I am hungry, and you look delicious. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna make sure no one's watching. Yeah. If this causes a crime, I'll reload. <laughs> no one saw it. We're out. Excellent. <laughs> right. All right. Let's just check the quest log. All right, Santa Monica. We've got Bertram Town wants us to go to the Nosferatu. That's fine. We'll go there eventually. Downtown, the Prince wants us to talk to No one cares. We gave that with anyone there, so we're off to Hollywood. Hollywood next. Let's go. Let's go talk to Isaac. Hello, Isaac. Evening. Evening. The flesh crafter who walked with royalty is not so crafty now. <laughs> Exceptional. I know. Come by in a little while. I should have something for you then. Oh, thank you. I wanted something Certainly. else. Uh, 
What come our idle hands make play things in your city? There is something, but it involves a gargoyle. A gargoyle? Hmm. I can see that's got your attention. Yeah, it is, because it's going to rip my face off. It's taken up residence in my beloved Asian theater. It is closed now, but that's beside the point. Oh, is I it? I sent some people to evict it, and it sent them back with a few less limbs. I can't have that monster attacking Kindred in my city. How does one smash it's a stone? It's a walking block of stone with a taste for blood. I'd suggest whatever method doesn't result in you being eviscerated. In so do fact, I. I'd rather have it as an ally, but I doubt it's going to be chatty. Here's the key for the theater. I'll leave it up to you. Oh, thanks. Certainly. Uh, Sing a song of sewer rats. The Nosferatu? I pity them, but I loathe their presence. I deal with them when it's necessary. I know they're beneath my city somewhere, but only they know where. Mm. They respect my streets, and I keep my politics out of their sewers. But I don't trust them by any stretch of the word. Yeah, I'm gone. I'm gonna go kill your gargoyle. I'll be back. <laughs> as much as I love this game, everything resorts in violence. And honestly, as a Magna Malkavian, I'm not particularly good at violence. Just saying. I'd rather just talk it out, to be honest. Not what I was picturing a gargoyle to look like, I have to admit. I'm a monster. Crush you, tear the flesh from your bones. Yeah, yeah whatever. Uh, ah, the stone golem I've come to slay. Goliath... Oh, no. Uh, calm your blood, Fuhrer. I will nothing but words. Talk. No. Always kindred are talking, scheming, hurting others with their lies. Monsters, you all. Abominations. A curse upon the earth. Okay. Uh, different we are, yet both damned and deathless. Let words be our battle. A cracked mirror will show you the true monster. Uh, it seems I will wear death's robes once again. Die. I bring you Olive Branch from the Blood Baron. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Blood Baron. Olive Branch. You speak in twisted words and lies, as all your kind do. Um, Abrams, he is the celluloid dream and offer extended hands. Arthur, what offer? Yet another <laughs> lie. He hopes to control me, to enslave me, just as my master before him. First he sends his underlings to destroy me, and now he wants to make peace. No! Curse him! Curse you all! I don't think that's gone well. He needs no slave, but a golem working for him. No! Well, death may not rule this dark day. Oh, bollocks. I'll pitch you to death your ass. And I got a broadsword. Doing one damage. If I just keep hitting. That did nothing. Oh! Have I broken it like I did the Zabisi things? Here, pillar. Come at me. Oh, he's alive again. Hit another pillar. Hurt yourself. Ow! I'll do something to it, surely. It's doing nothing. Come on, man. Come on. I'm doing 
doing something. Ugh. Stand over here. Stand in this light. do better. Strike us. <laughs> uh, shotgun. Happening here. Ow! Why did he do that? Maybe I can bring the roof down on him. Should we try that? Break, break the uh, ow! <laughs> right, I'm going to try blunt weapon this time because, you know, rocks smashing, blah blah blah. Well, let's see if we can persuade him not to kill us this time. Call your blood. Oh, that does do a lot of damage. Simple as changing your weapon. That is amazing. Now, I'll go back to the sword though, because the sword's great. Thank you very much. <laughs> All right, is there anything in here that I can pick up? Church. All right. Oh, there's something up here. Something up here. Hmm. Hello. Oh. Could I come in here? What's in here? <laughs> oh, hello. What's that for? Uh, Battlefield canister, tap hotel, shuffle step. Don't know what that's for. I'll keep it. Evening. Evening! About gifts you offered. And thanks again for your help earlier. I love to buy. And remember what I told you about LaCroix. You're good, kid. He doesn't deserve you. Evening. Evening! The stone, one lies in pieces. I thought you'd come back here with a stone foot lodged in your backside. I nearly did. I'm glad to see you've proved otherwise. Yeah, well. You've got a lot of promise. It's a shame you're still working full time for the wrong side. The children of the camera are my playmates. I like hope so. Well, if you'll excuse me. Thank you. All right, what's, what did I get? 
Pearl of Dubai. Oh, boost my, oh, boost my charisma. Very nice. Very, very nice. It means I could uh, seduce more people, shall we say. Excellent. Right, so... I don't think we've got anything left to do here. Yeah, that's down... To, I think we have to go to Chinatown now. Hey, off to Chinatown. Alright, so we're in Chinatown. Excellent. That building looks ominously important. Let's go check it out. You look weird. I'll deal with you later. No, oh, what's with the music? Why? I thought this was meant to be a nice place. Hello. Why'd you look so angry? Hello. Welcome, kindred. And thank you for respecting our traditions by announcing your presence in our domain. I am Ming Zhao, High Priestess to the people of Chinatown. Can I get you anything? Tea, perhaps? No. Ah, the Mistress of Mirrors. I'm sorry? I'm not sure I heard you correctly. Uh, the surface is cracked, tarnished, revealing more mirrors beneath. Oh, what wretched strain of Cain's curse is this? The best. Truth wears many masks, Mistress. Indeed it does, kindred. But let us speak of other things. How might I assist you? Uh, uh... I seek the Lost Laraku. Please, kindred. There is no need to be abrupt. I have no words to waste on you, Life Eater. Forgive my tr tremulous tongue, Mirror Mistress. Very well. Despite the hostility between our people, I would expect an agent of the Prince to behave civilly. Now might I offer you something? I am fickle in my food choice. Ah, that is right. Your kind drink solely of mortal blood, correct? No longer may you partake in the simple pleasures of the mortal realm. A shame. It is a shame. Tell me of your kind. We are called mistress. the Kuei Jin. Yes. Though you may know us as Eastern vampires. It is a grave misnomer, I can assure you. In a sense, yes. You may think of me as the Baron of Chinatown, to borrow from your course, Kainite language. Course? Rude. Are you not also <laughs> cursed by Kain? No. We are not simply some exotic Kainite bloodline. Shame. <laughs> we are supernatural. That does not mean we are like yourself. Rude. We are beings returned through the second breath for a purpose. Second breath of life, eh? So, so different the souls of Quajin and Kindred. We share superficial similarities. Quajin feed on essences that can be found in blood, yes. But as we refine our existence, rarely are we lowered to consume the bodily fluids of others. Lowered is great. While the rivers flow between us. Most of us are also banished from the realm of the sun. Oh. Although we suffer rot instead of burning, Ugh. the day's light is no more kind to our existence. The second breath, our rebirth into the supernatural form. It is a spiritual awakening, not some lowly blood ritual meant to spread a despicable curse. I don't know. You choose this supernatural state? No, we do not choose. But events of our lives can awaken dark spiritual energies. We are not born of the whims of another as the kindred are. Uh, okay. What reason behind the unfortunate fate? The reasons are as numerous as the Quajin themselves. Each is reborn with a purpose that Why they are you so angry? Find. Once their path is evident, they must seek to fulfill it, even if it takes eternity. Ah, no thanks. Your dressing is different, yet cursed also you are. On the contrary. It is another chance for us to find our place in the universe. A chance for transcendence. We are not damned, not burdened with an ancient guilt, as in the legend of your biblical progenitor. Well, I disagree. Have you here ears heard of the Ankaran Sarcophagus? Of course. The entire city is alight with news of its arrival and speculation about one of your ancient vampire grandfathers and his evil apocalyptic plot. You sound sceptical of this secret. Wei Jin do not share your history, nor do we share in your false prophecies. Oh, but you do. <laughs> what fullness, falseness find you in these foretellings? It all serves to distract the kindred. Such a distasteful existence you live. 
skulking in the shadows, fighting for scraps and fearing the return of your fictitious fathers, completely oblivious to your true purpose. They're not fictitious. Can you foretell kindred fate? No, I do not. But with my help, you might find the path you were meant for. Instead, you stumble through the afterlife, a meaty remnant still clinging to the mortal rib. Great stuff. Know you where lies the terrible box? We seek it, of course. I have two of my best agents looking. It could be a powerful bargaining tool. Uh, who are these agents? Let me just say that I do not encourage you to seek the Ankaran sarcophagus. Tough. May I mind your grey matter? What can I help you with? Uh, I like to seek the Nosferatu Nightchild. So, the great Nosferatu have lost an agent, have they? It was not by my hand, if that's what they think. No knowledge at all of the Nozzy. Nozzy? Perhaps you should speak with Wong Ho about this. I shall speak with this Wong Ho. Who is this Wong Ho? Wong Ho owns the Red Dragon restaurant. He is a prominent businessman who has garnered much respect among his people. If something is amiss in Chinatown, he may know how to help you. Oh, very nice. I will chase this deadly dragon. I grant you permission to operate in the Quajin domain. For now, may you find your path, kindred. I shall. Coolies. Right, okay, let's go to the Red Dragon. I think we passed that on the way in. Not sure. Deep nope. of the Atlantic. Dark. Dreaming. What? Sleeping. Do I follow them? Or do I go to the Red Dragon? They came from the Red Dragon. Right, let's go find out what's going on. Hello. Um, I'm sorry. Dinner service stopped a little while ago. But our lounge is still Go. open. The lounge is still open. I was directed here by the thing in the Golden Temple. I'll get the elevator. Well, that was easy. Second floor, have a good night. Thank you. She seemed intelligent. Hello? Blah 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 indeed. Oh, hello. They took her. They took her. Ah, your most precious treasure has been taken. Yes. Yes, she has. Kiki, my daughter, is indeed my most treasured possession. How did you know? You just said they took her, they took her. I think I could work it out. Against love. You are correct. Trust. She was kidnapped by the tongue. A tom. A local street gang. Right. Are they human? I do not know who ordered this, but I intend to find out. Who are you, stranger? You seem to see things as if through the eyes of the gods. Well, I, I do have godly eyes. You're well, well versed in charming me, sir. Often gods dress as demons. I come from Ming Zhao, mistress of mirrors. Ming Zhao? Oh, of course. Please forgive me, but as you can see, I am in a most terrible situation. I am Wang Ho, owner of the Red Dragon. Again, I apologize for my inconsiderate behavior. Uh, tell me your tale. The Tong. A local street gang here in Chinatown just broke into my restaurant and kidnapped my daughter at gunpoint. Guns aren't worrying. The Tong grow more bold every day, and now... They have my kiki. Uh, I will find your lost treasure. Do you know where they buried? Can't no. See, the Tong have many... Uh, my eyes gone, uh, though. Wait. Please excuse me a moment. Hello. Zhao. Huh? Yes. How did you... Of course. He's in on it. I'm Let's... calling it now. <sighs> Thank you, my friend. Your debt has been repaid a thousand times over. Yes. Of course. Goodbye. Not the lost children on, on that line, but who? That was someone who owed me an old debt. It has been repaid. I know where the Tong are keeping my daughter. Perhaps I can help you dig for your precious girl. Kiki is being held at the Lotus Blossom, a massage parlor here in Chinatown. If you bring her back to me, I will help you in any way that I can. I shall return with your precious treasure. I 
I shall wait here Whoa. until you return. Made in rage. Strike fast. The Tong will not be expecting anyone so soon. Good luck, my friend. I'm not your friend. I've just met you. And I now I'm becoming Kiki at Delivery Service. Ah, oh, Kiki Delivery Service. Right, hang on. What else can I steal from this place? Ooh, what's that? Ooh, very stuff. Nothing else. All right. Bone rattle melodies and worm laden rain. The voices are getting much more frequent at the moment. I don't know what's going on. Oh, uh, get out of the way. Oh, hello. You look weird. Okay. Bartender! Lu Fang got American history test for you. Ooh. Who was the president when I ordered my last drink, huh? Ha! <laughs> you know? Shut up. <laughs> right, so we're going to the something Lotus. I say we just look for. Ladies of the night, we should find it. Thank you. They ran this way, so we'll go this way. Right, what's that? Oh, the Lotus Blossom. Is this the place? Let's just walk in. <laughs> what are they going to do? What are they going to do? I think I might fire up Voice of Bedlam. Is that the one? I'll have to check it. What's that? <laughs> right. Hello. I can't talk to you. Hello. Yep, you definitely look the part of a masseuse. As do you, love. Right. <laughs> They definitely had done themselves in the outfits in this one, didn't they? That right, stairs. Alright, upstairs. They used a lot of blood. A lot of blood. I'm, just gonna, I'm gonna eat you. Come here. Come here. Come here. All right. You had this coming. Where is he? Abandoned, did nothing. Ay, ay, ay. Right. Toilets. I very much doubt there's going to be a women's toilet. Just saying. Oh, hello. Underhanded, underhanded. Same in here, right. I dread to think what's on these ones. Hello. Excuse me? No. I was hoping I could feed on it, but that's fine. Condoms. A lounger. This is gross. There's one with a padlock. Hello. Stairs down again. Hello. You son of a bitch! I can't. I can't breathe in here. Uh, I've come to free you from from the lost children. What? Aren't you a little tall for a tongue? I am no toothless. Tall. 
You know, like, not short, Jesus. All you thugs are the same. Stupid, stupid, and stupid. You are Wong Ho's little weasel. Yeah, I'm Kiki. Who the hell are you? The Tong Welcoming Committee? I bring you freedom's oh, key. I'm so impressed. What? Like you want me to thank you or something? In your dreams, asshole. Let's exit Lair of the Lost Children. Close your food hole or you'll stay here in your cage. Okay, okay. Man, you don't have to get all sensitive. I'm sorry, okay? You, you had it coming, bitch. All right, why is this, why is all your words, little weasel? Let's get out of here. You got trousers on, mate. What are you doing? Where the hell? Where am I? <gasps> Come here. Aha. Uh -huh. Where is she? You rescue Kiki. So you feel like killing her instead? You should go back to Wong Ho. <laughs> it's not wrong. It's not wrong. What? The dark father returns? No, he's not. No, he's not. No, oh, he is I'm not. Oh, I'm so impressed. On, what? Like you want me to thank hey, you or Serena, something? In your you dreams, asshole. Yeah, he is. Yes, you he sound is. like a broken record, yes, little he weasel. Totally is. I know. I was just on the phone with Andrea, and I was all, no, Hello? he's not. Ah, welcome, my friend. I owe you a debt of gratitude. I don't know why. You have returned to me my greatest treasure. Kiki told me how you rescued her. You are a man of great courage and honor. Thank you. Ah, you know why the lost children did take your precious treasure? No, I have not been able to find out why they took Kiki. But I fear that it goes much deeper than the tongue. Your words are slightly opaque. For a long time, I have been trying to clean up Chinatown. It was a difficult job, but the community came together, and we started to take back our streets from criminals like the Tong. Very nice. Businesses reopened. Families moved back into their homes. These lost children are strong. Yes. I thought that the Tong were almost gone, but then something happened. Their numbers began to grow, and suddenly they had a lot of money to buy weapons. With them followed the drugs and the violence. It is almost worse now than before. Oh, okay. Who is a hand that pulls the strings? I do not know, but there is a change in the air. Mm. I meditate, but my spirit is restless. The words of the I Ching are dark and unclear. Everything seemed to change as soon as... Uh, Give voice to your vexings. I am sorry. I have said too much. Then let us delve into my own dilemma. Of course. What can I help you with? I seek the shadow of the missing soul. Who is this person? Barabbas. Hmm. What else can you tell me about him? It seems my personalities persist in their silence. I see. I do not think I could find him for you, but I know someone who could. Cool. Where can I find this person? His name is Zhao. He is the man who called me and told me where Kiki was being held. Mm, very nice. Zhao has many connections. He owns an import-export warehouse in Chinatown. Go and see him there. I will call ahead and tell him to expect you. Take me a picture of Chinatown. What would you like to know? The Temple of Virtuous Gold. The Temple of Golden Virtue has been here in Chinatown for a long, long time. Even before I was born. For many years it was old and forgotten. But Ming Zhao bought it and restored it to its former glory. Why does the mistress cast her shadow from the Golden Temple? Ming Zhao holds our culture and our traditions in very high regard. The temple is a symbol of our strength as a people. It brings hope to the community. Oh, very nice. Uh, 
I'm done. I'm out. Let's go. You can piss off. I do not like you. Don't like you. I will kill you. Just saying. Right, so apparently we need to go and talk to Zhao at the import-export business. Where is that? Zhao's Imports, number seven. I am here, so if I go down this alleyway, I should find it. Aha! Here we go. I think we'll leave that until next time. So we need to go in here and talk to Zhao to see if he knows where Barabas is. Got quite a Atlantic. bit done there, actually, to be honest. So I was quite happy with that. The voices are definitely getting much more frequent. I don't know if that's a good sign. I think it might be because my dementation's maxed out. Either way, anyway, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like and a comment down below and subscribe if you feel that way inclined. But we'll return to Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines at a later time. But I will see you in the next video.